One of the best analogies for a real estate syndication is to think of it as an airplane ride. There are pilots, passengers, flight attendants, mechanics, and more, and all work together to get the plane safely to its destination. Hi there, I'm Harry Nima Segarra, founder of Nima Equity. Today, I'll introduce you to the key roles in a real estate syndication. In the analogy I just mentioned, the pilots represent the sponsors of the syndication, and the passengers are the passive investors. They are all going to the same place, but they have very different roles in the process. The pilots are responsible for the flight. If any issues emerge, such as weather that causes turbulence or any issues with the plane, and even though they will keep the passengers updated, the passengers don't have any responsibilities regarding the decisions the pilots make. A real estate syndication is much like this. The passive investors, sponsors, brokers, property managers, and more all share a vision to invest in and improve a particular asset or property. However, each person's role in the project is different. So let's talk about exactly who those players are, as well as their respective roles in a real estate syndication. First, the real estate broker is a person or team who puts the property for sale, either as a listing or as an off-market opportunity. Having a strong real estate broker is vital, as they are the main liaison between the buyer and the seller throughout the acquisition process. Next, the lender, not the passive investor, is the biggest money partner in the real estate syndication, because they provide the loan for the property. The lender performs their own due diligence, underwriting, and separate appraisal to make sure the property is worth the value of the loan requested. Then we have the general partners. They work with the real estate broker and lender to secure the loan and acquire the property in addition to managing the asset throughout the life of the project. This is why they are often also called the lead syndicators. The general partnership team includes both the sponsors and the operators. The sponsors are the ones signing on the dotted line for the loan and are often involved in the acquisition and underwriting processes. The operators are generally responsible for managing the acquisition and for executing the business plan by overseeing the day-to-day -day operations like property management and keeping renovations on budget. The next key players are the key principles. For a commercial loan, the sponsor is required to show a certain amount of personal liquidity and net worth. This reassures the lender that the sponsor can contribute additional personal capital to keep the property afloat if things were to ever go wrong. One or more key principles may be brought into the deal to help warranty the loan if the sponsor's personal balance sheet is insufficient. The majority of a real estate syndication is made up of the next group, the passive investors, who have no active role in the project. They invest their money in exchange for a share of the returns. Like the passengers on an airplane, they get to put their money in, sit back, and enjoy the ride. Once the property has been acquired, we need a property manager. The property manager becomes arguably the most important partner in the project because they are the boots in the ground. The property manager works closely with the operators to ensure the project is running according to the business plan. So where does NEMA Equity come in? In a real estate syndication, NEMA Equity is part of the general partnership. Our main role is to lead investor relations and help raise the equity needed. We serve as an advocate for investors by ensuring that the sponsor's projections are conservative, deals are structured favorably toward investors, that multiple exit strategies exist, and that capital will be preserved and grow. After the property is acquired, we are the liaison between the sponsor team and the investors by providing updates, financial reports, and other important information. A real estate syndication, by definition, is a group investment and it's only through pooling resources and coordination that the syndication can be successful. While all the respective roles are different, they are all needed to ensure the success of the syndication. If you're interested in learning more about real estate syndications and how they can help you take advantage of all the benefits of real estate without becoming a landlord, join the NIMA Equity Doctors Investing Club today. You'll find the link down below in the description. And finally, if you like this video, hit that like button below, share with a friend, and be sure to subscribe. I'm Harry Nima Segarra with Nima Equity. 
Thank you so much for watching and I will see you again next week. Thank you.